Hello and welcome to the 365 Project. What do you do when you look outside and all you see is rain and all you hear is horrible wind, 100 mile an hour winds or something and, and what do you do? What do you do? You put a big smile on your face and you go out and you get your steps in. That's what I'm talking about. Hello, good morning everybody. It's Saturday, it's the weekend. Welcome to day 286 of the 365 project. 79 days to go till the end of the project, till the end of the year. And then no more mandatory walking for me out in horrible, horrible weather like this. It's totally unacceptable, totally demoralizing. But you know what? I'm going to turn that frown upside down. And I'm going to go out and get some steps because that's what I do, baby. No, seriously, though. Wow, it looks absolutely horrendous. Horrendous out there. <sighs> but that aside, we've got a job to do. We've got steps to hit. I've even got my hood up indoors. That's how bad it is outside. It's that bad outside. I'm wearing my hood indoors. So yeah, the 365 project rolls on and t days like today pff, can knock morale, you know what I mean? People are going to say, I'm just going to put the heating on and I'm going to get a blanket and I'm going to sit on the couch and I'm going to hibernate. But me, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to get me waterproofs on, I'm going to go outside and I'm going to endure this horrible weather. The sooner I get it done, the sooner it's done, and then I can hibernate, and then I can put the heating on and dry off, and all that kind of horrible, horrible, horrible weather related banter. Oh man, looking at that, oh my word. You can't really see it, but it is raining. <sighs> oh, way. Oh yeah, mad shout out props to Sean, Sean J. Getting the job done last night on the Workweek Hustle. Unfortunately for me, I couldn't add to my target because I was busy with work and by the time I looked when it had finished, you'd got the win. So massive, massive props, mate. You got the job done. <coughs> Let's see what this weekend warrior is all about, shall we? Invitations are already out and up and running, so we've got a few people who've took advantage and got involved. We'll wrap up the workweek hustles when we get back, see who's done what, who's got what and where, and who finished where. But for now, it's time to go outside in this. Well, here we go once again. When I woke up this morning, first of all, I was having some lethal patter with people and they were telling me how awful the weather is. They, they were already out and about and were saying it's absolutely terrible. I didn't want to look outside because I thought if I did, I'd just be underwater because it sounded like it had been raining all night. The wind was hellacious. Not the kind of conditions you want to be going out and getting your steps in, but that's what we're doing. This is what the project is all about. So we decided... Nice big walk today, and that's where we're starting off. We're going round by the train station up by the complex, swinging it round by through to the Sim Pasture Walk part, heading up towards the Blue Bridge, and then ultimately all the way around, sort of towards the Gretna Green, and round by the Sports Club, and up towards Woodham School, down the Burn, up through, up to, across the sort of Stag Lane. And then up through the Bluebell Woodsy parts, round by Greenfield School and back home. It was uh, tough going at the start. And funny story, when I went to go and get some water because I didn't take any out, um, I ended up getting a, a chicken tikka sandwich as well. And long story short, an angry looking wasp got in my face. And those who know me know that I don't take well to stings and... If anyone was watching me walking about, I was knocking out some queer moves. I was, uh, it was about a, th it was a three minute sustained attack by this wasp, I might add. And, um, yeah, I was kind of jumping about and I had my hands full. I had a bottle of water. I had my selfie stick. I had my sandwich. I didn't have anywhere to put anything. So I was just kind of trying to swat it with my shoulders, this thing, because I was, <laughs> I didn't have any arms. 
And it kept on coming at me and coming at me. It was right in my face. I ended up having to chuck my sandwich at it to try and get it away. So I was pretty angry about that because that was breakfast technically. So I only had half a sandwich. But yeah, if anyone was seeing me walking around, they would have been thoroughly entertained because I was jumping about, swinging my arms and swearing on. And yeah, it was crazy. But <laughs> we've ended up going a very fair distance to be fair no football today so we've decided to go overboard on the steps but we were tooled up with our waterproof storm brick trousers on we got our walking boots on and we hit the tracks hard i didn't even look at the steps once while i was round going round on this walk today because i was up wrapped up with all my layers I, it was just too much of a chew so i thought i'll wait till i get home see how we've done See if we've had a successful day getting the steps in. Let's find out. Wow. Absolutely shattered, like. Massive shout out to Spotify. Not a single repeated song. I need to get this jacket off. Not a single repeated song. And we've been out for ages. I don't even know what time it is. Well, I do now. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm wetter on the inside than I was on the outside because of all the layers I've got on. I'm absolutely sweating to the max. <sighs> Jesus. But we're done. Might as well get this finished off as well. Had to buy water. I didn't take water with me. So I had to buy some. Because I hit critical, look at this, critical temperatures, like I was overheating. The last sort of two, like third or half of that walk, I was walking around with me coat unzipped, me hoodie unzipped. <coughs> the, <pay> <coughs> the pace slowed right down. I wasn't tired as such. I was just way, way, way too hot like. Let's have a quick check of the old social media whilst we've just sat down. Yeah, we've done that. Yeah. Really good long walk. This was a byproduct of there not being any Premier League football on today. So I thought, I'm going to walk out in this horrible wind and rain. Lasted about half an hour and then I've been literally like that the entire way around. Whew. But we're back. It's team step check it. It's half past two. Du, 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 du. Check that out. 22,065 steps. That's lethal. Boom. Ticked off the list in style, I might add. Oh, in style. We've absolutely nailed it today. Looked outside and thought, oh yeah, that mint weather we've got. Psych. And then, uh, yeah, that was it. Three hours later, or however long it's been. And we're back. I need to check up on Workweek Hustle results, because I haven't done that yet. And I'll check up on the Weekend Warriors. I know there was a couple of late stragglers coming into the mix. Bit of a slow uptake, but we, uh, we're there and thereabouts now. See how everybody else has been getting on. Wow, I don't smell great. Whew. And, uh, yeah. Sit myself down, because I am tired. I need... Five minutes, damn. <sighs> Fill up on some water. Ugh. Hit up the old five and five water technique and smash that because that's nearly done. And then, yeah, chill out because I am shattered. <sighs> so, yeah, we've set, set a good pace to the weekend, Warrior. We're going to see what tomorrow brings, see how this rolls into Monday, way day, see if we can get another loss on the scales. Not long left to go of this project now. Want to get this final result over the line. And then I can enjoy the fruits of my labour, if that makes sense. So that's it. I've been Aaron from the Highlight Reel. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to stay safe and stay active. And above all else, keep it real. And in case you're wondering, Tesco's have a half-price toy sale on. The 13th of October 2018.
day 286 of the 365 project it's a saturday and the walk has been truly epic today the highlight reel capturing the images of the journey out today and there's many things going through my mind when i first woke up this morning being that i don't want to get out of bed <laughs> standard and I could hear the weather outside. I didn't want to look at it. I wasn't prepared to see what was happening. And then once we got out and about, up and up and you know, in the house, seeing what was going on, we looked outside, and well, it wasn't ideal. But as we seen there in the video, we had our game plan today. We had a rock solid game plan, and that was go out wrap up against the elements and do what you got to do get the job done get it over the line and then the rest is history so that was the approach that we took to today whatever means necessary get the job done if it was sideways rain if it was freezing then so be it we were prepared we had our boots we had our waterproofs we were ready to go and it's been a great day to be fair, walk wise, step wise, water target wise, everything's gone cushy. The weekend warrior results, uh, sorry, the work week hustle results even are in. And out of the three that I was in this week, I won one. Heather won one. Well done, Heather. And Sean J won one. Well done, Sean. You pulled that out of the bag late last night. Good effort. I can see as well from how people generally, what kind of steps they're put out. I say generally, you would say on average what kind of output people are doing, and now it's uh, get seems to be people are getting higher and doing more. So seeing people put more effort in is is good. It's encouraging. It breeds healthy competition within the hustles, and everyone sees a benefit at the end of it. With the weekend warriors now in full flow, I'm top of the top of the tables in all of those so far. But obviously we've got still got plenty of time for people to get more steps in. And then we roll into tomorrow without a clear game plan just yet, but we'll get one formulated and then, yeah, see what Monday has in store. Hopefully a loss on the scales. One step closer to where we want to be. And that is a 7 stone weight loss of 13 stone and 4 pounds. We're 9 pounds off just at the moment and our race at your pace is over schedule. We've over target for two weeks so far. So it's all looking good, it's all looking positive, just keep the momentum going and the results will follow.